up everybody this is your girl midnight these are skinless chicken thighs okay i just got them soaking right now in some vinegar and water to clean this kind of stuff like this you pull this off you know so when we do our final rinse i will take a lot of that off and you see that's like fat like under the skin kind of fat you want to take that off of your chicken but it's boneless so this is nothing but meat we'll just re take some of that off as this sits in the water this is vinegar and water over here i have all of my vegetables that i will be cutting up so we like to use yellow red bell pepper green and onion this is going to be smothered chicken so you want to use this chicken base bouillon and these are my other seasonings. So I like the Goya. I like that rotisserie chicken seasoning. We got a little bit of uh, onion powder, that vegetable, some black pepper, sea salt, cayenne pepper, and then to get a better look at the Goyas right there. And then of course, the Zazon. Okay, so here's all of the scraps. And as I told y'all, we had to clean some of that fat off that chicken. That's kind of like what I mean. Like, you know, get that off of there. Now, I didn't put all of my seasonings on my chicken. And I'm going to show you the cut up vegetables that I did. Here's my vegetables cut up. So we have the yellow banana bell peppers, the green, the red. And I have all of my onions here. Again, this is the bras of the seasonings that I'm using. Now, for smothered chicken, you need self-rising flour. You can use water or chicken broth because water does it as well, but I'm going to be using chicken broth. So next, I'm just going to mix up my chicken. Then we're going to start to add flour and broth and kind of mix before we put these veggies in. And I'll show you the next step after that. Okay, this is the finish. So this is what you call oven smothered chicken. You see how that gravy and the stuff look like that right now? That's flour, and that is also chicken broth, but you can also use this with water, doing water and flour alone. I added a couple scoops of butter into this chicken, and we have the peppers in there. We have the onions and all of that stuff in there, and all I'm going to do is cover this with some heavy-duty aluminum foil, which is our lid, and we poke holes in this. And this is how oven smothered chicken is made. All right, y'all. It is your girl Midnight. Y'all see the finish with all the rest of the meal when it's finished. All right.